Reaching Formula One for myself has been my lifelong dream. There's only 20 drivers in Formula One. You have to give it your absolute everything. I think a lot of people don't associate Formula One with being a very physical sport. Over the course of a lap, you've got up to five Gs of force going through your body and your neck. Imagine yourself laying on the side of your bed and somebody puts 50 kilos on the side. That's pretty much what it feels like uh, driving through a high-speed corner. I've been with Alesha for, for three years now. Ah, one. Oh, last one. Ah. From the moment we met, I kind of made it clear to him that my goal is Formula One. I've seen him grow, I've seen him develop. He has improved a lot in so many areas and we'll always uh, try to improve a little bit more as well. He does a fantastic job to, to push me to my limits and to really get the most out of me. Our main pre-season training was based in, in Landrossi. We mainly focus on doing a lot of cycling to build up that cardio strength because I've only been racing one hour races previously. And now in Formula One, we can be racing for two hours, so that's very important. We have to treat these guys like what they are. They are Formula One drivers. We use gravity, we use inertial resistance, we use elastic bands, manual resistance, everything we can. And also all the cognitive stress brings the heart rate up. So we try and do a lot of cardio, but also stressing the mind at the same time. We have to remember these guys are all winners and high achievers. So when something doesn't go right, it puts them in a really dark place. There's so many things you, you need to think about. Where do I break? Where do I turn? Defending from a guy, attacking a driver. And there's so much that goes on with it. And that kind of adds to the cognitive stress. It is difficult to mentally prepare for an F1 season, especially being a rookie because I've never experienced it before. I believe I'm ready, but you just don't know. It just feels like a huge achievement to make it into Formula One, but I don't want to be complacent. I think having that really strong pre-season, I know that there's not really anything more we could have done from a physical aspect. Formula One is my dream, and to finally be in this point with such a fantastic team is going to be amazing just working together to all achieve that, that same goal we have. That goal is ultimately to, to go out there and drive as fast as possible.